This right here is the friend that we all need, but the friend <laughs> we never want. <laughs> Let's get straight into the video. This is wild. Hey, you went to school with Tisha, huh? Yeah, she's from BMT. She, uh, she right. Man, she look cheap nasty. I know you know Tish. Man, it used to be popping. Huh? Huh? Used to be popping. Hey, you know Paul that her. Hey, you know everything. Yeah, I'm not ready for what to happen, man. What this dude right here is out of pocket, but it is necessary. And a lot of y'all need a friend like this because a lot of y'all be worn by your homies, your cousins, your family members, and y'all ignore it. This is the reality check that a lot of you dudes need when <laughs> you cuff up the wrong girl and everybody warns you and you tell them you don't know her like I do. Get ready for this, people. <laughs> this is gonna take an unexpected turn. Hey, what you mean? What I mean, man? What we talking about? Man, your gal, I told you, I told you. I oh, 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 no. His homie just said, just in case you didn't hear it, he looked up to him. He's like, man, what t shirt you talking about? He said, yo, girl, homie, that's who I'm talking about. I told you about that girl. I told you how she got down. My man, it gets worse, people. Oh, my God. Yo, shout out to the dude, though, because. Amongst guys, we all know how we really talk. And he was really like, not really trying to say too much, but he was kind of forcing it out of him, because again, he had an agenda. But let's see how the guy reacts right now. Keisha, boyfriend. I told you, bro. I told you. I don't know how to dance, but can lean. Man, because he needs to know. Listen, shout out to the dude. He is a good dude. He genuinely is a good dude, right? Because. First of all, that guy's girl, get around. She for the streets, you know what I'm saying? And he wasn't really dogging her out the way a lot of dudes do, you know? And the fact that he did that to that guy, he felt bad automatic. He's like, damn, bro, like, why you gotta be like that for? Why you gotta do that? Because every man knows that that's the last thing that he will ever want to hear about the woman that he loves. Oh, no, bro, you, you, you don't just, I can't let him do it. You want me to just be like, what if he, uh, you want me to go to the wedding and just be like, yes, he did. But guess what? Desperate times call for desperate measures he didn't want to do that but he had already warned his best friend somebody who's like a brother to him somebody he loves and he does not want to see go down that path because he knows what lies ahead of him and he would not listen he would not listen so you know what he did he brought him to the spot you know chilling with the homies and he forced them to see the reality that he was voluntarily Blinded himself to. It ain't exposed. I, this is my fans. I gotta tell my man the truth. I'll be a bad partner if I didn't. He is the truth. He'd be a really bad friend if he didn't tell him and he knew this about the guy because he didn't hear. Like he knew and he brought a guy to confirm what he knew. And that's just one guy. I'll be a bad partner if I didn't. Why you so disrespectful, bro? Disrespectful? He's not disrespectful. I'm pretty sure he brought this up to you in a very respectful way before. And you did not listen to him. You said, nah, bro, you tripping, homie. Nah, that ain't true, bro. I spoke to her. She said, we don't like that. She said, motherfuckers lying on her name. That's what she said, right? And then you hit him with a classic, oh, you don't know her like I do, bro. Trust me, trust me, bro. She good. She good out here, bro. She's a good girl, man. I love her. I want to marry her. Pfft, I'm talking about why it got to be disrespectful. Hey, how is that disrespectful? Yo, I feel so bad for the other guy, man, because he feels like shit. And he's like, bro, that was like back in college. Like, they were probably wasn't even together at the time. Or even if there was, it doesn't matter. Like, you don't got to say, I know that was your girl. He feels bad. He's like, oh, my God, I would hate to be this guy right now. <laughs> oh, man. Yo, but the silence in the room amongst the other dudes, though, ain't nobody saying nothing. They're like, yo, this is crazy. I know this is what we came here for. I was wondering where the weed was. Ah, man, why no weed here? Ain't no drinks, man. We just chilling sober. Who chills sober? Yeah, that boy knew better than to bring drugs into this equation. He in love and shit. know, bro. Come on, bro, bro. That was, that was yeah. in college. Oh, she disgusted. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, man, he's 
said she's disgusting. He's trying to justify. I said, nah, bro, that was in college. She changed. That's probably the same thing, the same game that his girl's gonna run up on her. Nah, that was in college. You know, I was young and stupid. I'm gonna hit or something, bro. I already hit. I said, I said, I already Oh, damn, he hit it too. Ooh. What trying to tell him? She trying to just try to give me hugs. She trying to just try to give me hugs. You brought homie, you brought homie over here just to expose him. Wow, man, this is rough, man. This is rough. That guy's taking it like a champ. He's getting up. He's like, you know what? I'm going to leave, man. I can't take it. I'm about to start crying over here right now. Oh, my God. Hey, some people need this, though. This is the reality check that a lot of people need, man, because when you're blinded by love, dude, could nobody get you to see that. A lot of people will literally have it on video and be like, nah, nah, that ain't her, bro. That's not, nah, 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 nah that ain't her. He found out today. Come on, bro. You get beat up and shit like that. Ain't nobody gonna whoop. Ain't nobody gonna whoop, ain't nobody gonna whoop me. <laughs> He said, you can get beat up and shit like that. He's like, ain't nobody gonna whoop me. I could tell by the bass on his voice, he's a really big guy. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody gonna whoop me. Let him speak for himself. I'm this my father. I'm telling my man the truth. Yeah, let him speak for himself. He's a grown ass man. He's looking out for him. Listen, I know this is not a way that we would ever want to hear something like this, but guess what? It's necessary. It's necessary, people, man. This shit ain't easy, man. When you fall in love with the wrong woman, man, and she has a dark past, that's not an easy reality to come to terms with, man. If this guy is a real man, eventually he'll leave her and he'll come back and be like, yo, bro, I hate you for what you did, but I love you for what you saved me from. I already told him I ain't what Bro, don't tell him that he's not even mad at you. He's just disappointed. Like, damn, this shit really did happen. Cause at that point, there's proof. You know, nobody knew that this was gonna happen. You brought homie up here. Come on, bro. Yeah, like that, bro. Man, I, I thought I was doing the right thing. Hey, hey, you are doing the right thing. Don't allow anybody to convince you otherwise, bro. You have that man has no idea the heartache that you saved him from down the line whatever pain he's feeling now bro is a hundred times less than when she ends up sleeping with one of his friends or somebody close to him or the guy she told him not to worry about I guess I'm I'm high, bro. am i tripping am i tripping am i yeah, that's what I'm talking about. You see, he said, he's like, I'm a tripping, bro. He's now nah, I'm on the same shit. If the broski would have been there, I was like, bro, what took you so long? You should have let me know, bro. I hit too. I wasn't just trying to say nothing. You know what I'm saying? But since we were already doing this, we could have really planned it. We could have really planned this out. Man, I don't gotta be here. Yeah, he definitely a big dude, man, because when he got up, he looking down. Like, that camera looking down at him. Usually you hold your camera right here, so <laughs> he walked away. You don't want none of those problems. Shout out to him. Those are the kind of friends that I like, which is why I don't have any friends, because most dudes ain't built like that. You know what I'm saying? Usually the dudes that are built like that, they end up being lone wolves because no one want to be around them. Nobody want to be around people like that because nobody want to know the truth. Everybody wants to live in a convenient lie. Peace! Is it desperate measures require desperate means?